Conley. The one question I get asked more than anything, perhaps more than any question at all, is why, Steve Dog, didn't you go into espionage? That's the question you were probably thinking a moment ago. Well, the reason I think espionage wasn't ready for the Steve Dog. Anyway, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you me taking on the world of espionage as we enter into... See that? I got hit there. Yeah, by a villain. As we enter into the world that is metal, gear, solid. Follow this. This is going to be a series. This is going to be the best. Steve Dog is going to show you this as a hack, as a guide, and as a way to be in the world of covert operations that Steve Dog does Metal Gear Solid Part 1. Right folks, welcome to PS Classic Fun yet again. This time we're playing the old PlayStation 1 Classic Metal Gear Solid. Oh God. I'm going to go normal. I'm rubbish at these games, but I'm going to go normal. Here we go then. So just for you guys who've never, ever played these games before, basically. Can you hear me? Looks like what? I have to take the elevator, make sure that nobody sees me. If you need to, contact code out frequently 140.85. Remember that, readers. When you want to use the code button, press select. I need to help with contact you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Got to get to the lift, folks. We don't need to worry about that, do we? We're talking Steve Dog here. Yeah, we just got to get on with it. I don't even know what the controls are. I love the theme, the theme still going on here. If I can swing, I reckon I've come out of there. Look at that, it's like a film. They make it a bit like a film. I'm gonna crawl under there backwards. That's the way to get through that one, guys. Not conventional, I will admit. There's a little radar there. So we can see up there. Now, I don't know. Scope six. Six. You can even get cigarettes in this. What on earth is it? Oh, there oh, we go. James Euler. Oh, look at this. This is great, isn't it? Right, let's go. I can punch. That's all you need to know, guys. Steve Dog can punch. See that then. What? Cool. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Blooming mum or something. Do you know that? Press select. Snake. There's an elevator there. You can take up to the ground. You told me that, you chump. To I'm sneaking around here. Yeah. There's all sorts of you know, guards and stuff going around. I get a bloody phone call. I don't even have it on silent. That's the sort of guy I am. Rationed, yeah, because I'm hungry already. What the hell is this? Jump in the leg later. Oh my God, there's a button here or something I've got to press. No, they make these games. Yeah, right, because I can hide up by the lift. Shit, someone come in. Oh no. As you can see, the dots on the top right there. That guy's coming around. Oh, hide around the corner. Hide around the corner. Oh, there's another one there. I think we're okay. No. Oh, the lift is coming down. Of its own accord. Oh 
Oh no, there's no guard going to get out of that lift, isn't there? Oh no, what am I going to do? Hello. Oh, I'm such a girl at these games. Oops. And the car and get stuff. Ha! Steve Dog. Sneaky, sneaky Steve Dog. Oh yeah. He's got through the lift. I haven't killed anyone. They don't even know I'm there. That's what you get with Steve Dog, folks. Like my cod piece there. What you get there is sneakiness. Yes. You get a whole new level of sneak. What's he doing? Taking his clothes off. You get a whole new level of sneakiness. What's he doing? He's taking his stuff off. Here we go. Look at this. Look. Look at that. He's not going to fall off his bike, is he? This is like a movie, isn't it, folks? Sit back and enjoy this film. We're five minutes in. Metal Gear Solid. Tactical espionage action. you got to admit, even though it's an old game, it's great, isn't it? This was quality. I never got very far because I only ever had the demo. That's part of the reason. And only got you to the lift, I think. I think it might have been. I think I've previously gone outside on this, like we're talking 20 years ago. I think I crawled around under a car. I think that's about all I did. I was too frightened to go anywhere else. Of course, that's when I was young. Now I'm old and mean. And fear. I fear nothing now in this game, as you'll find out. We're going to go for another five minutes. Oh, here we go, the phone's ringing again. Oh my god, have you left your crisps at home? Exosnake. Ah, yeah, that's gone Steve Dog. Oh, hello. Oh, cheeky. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Yeah, on my mouse. F-16s just took off from Galena and are headed your way. Two F-16s. Radar should have already picked them up. Right. Okay, folks, there's a couple of F-16s coming in here. Steve Jobs going to clear the way. Fine B. Colonel, what's a Russian gunship doing here? Oh. Slip in where? Slip in what? Slip into the helicopter or slip into the base? Not slip into the helicopter. Steve Dog has just taken off you. Crazy yet amazingly admired buffoon. Right, here we go. It's time to sneak in unnoticed. Right, here we go. Hours left until their deadline. Good. You've got to hurry. I'm gonna hurry, mate. Don't worry. Wow. Yeah. Who's that? This is Mei Ling. She was assigned to us as our visual and data processing specialist. Nice. As well as your Soliton radar system. Oh yeah. Contact her if you have any questions about either of them. Ding dong. Nice to meet you, Snake. Nice to meet you. Thank you. I'm called Steve Dog. What's wrong? I need a way. I just didn't expect a world class designer of military technology to be so cute. <laughs> oh, You're just flattering me. Flattering me. No, I'm, I'm serious. Well, I know I won't be bored for the next 18 hours. Oh, it's got all the lines, this guy. Oh. But uh, I'm surprised. You're such, You're such a flirt you. snake, aren't you? Looks like we both have a lot to learn about each other. Ding dong. Hmm. But first, let me explain about your solar Do you have to? We've got like minutes to get in here. The bright dot in the middle is you, Snake. Okay. The red dots are your enemies. Nice. The blue cone shape represents their field of vision. We got that. Be careful, Snake. Oh, no. Genome soldiers have highly developed sensors of hearing and vision due to their gene therapy. Cool. Make sure you don't let them see you. 
Right. First, I want you to infiltrate the disposal site and look for the DARPA chief. The DARPA chief was injected with the same oh, DPS dear, as the nanomachines as you. You should appear on your radar as a green dot. All right. Get whatever information you can from him about the terrorists. If he's alive, that is. I only just rocked up today. They haven't even properly security cleared me. I don't even know where the canteen is. Well, thanks for that. It's all made from currently existing technology. You won't be able to use it in an area with strong harmonic resonance, so be careful. We'll be monitoring your movements by radar. My movements? <laughs> Guess I nip off to the toilet. Ding dong. Thank you. I'm also in charge of your mission data. Contact me if you want me to record. They don't rattle on, don't they? I'm not going to remember all these numbers, am I? I'm going to end up ringing up the local council or something. Remember, except for your binoculars, your name. Sorry? You need to arm yourself with whatever weapons you can find. I remember. First, I'm strip searched by Dr. Naomi. Sorry? And all my weapons are taken away. What's going on? With that position. No thanks. Back in one piece, maybe I'll let you do a strip search on me. Ho ho. Oh, oh, oh. By the way, sorry to disappoint you, but I did manage to smuggle out my smokes. Well, ding dong. You do that? Oh, I don't know. In my they stomach. Gave me to suppress my stomach acids. So you can get some cigarettes. How are those going to help you? You never know. You never know. He can use them as explosives, isn't he? Or maybe I just give the guy some tabs, as we say. If you want to get in, there's the front door. Where? Five, five, six of them pineapples. What the hell's pineapples? Oh my god. Okay, guys. What? Cool. These guys haven't got a Scooby that I'm useless at this. I don't know what they're on about. COA? You're counting on me? Yeah, he won't be for very long, mate. Right. Right, okay, that allows me. I can look around. Oh, that's handy. By pressing the triangle button just for you guys. I can duck down. I can stand up. Oh, shit. Oh god, that didn't go very well, did it? Whoops. Slide around the corner. Oh god. Blimmin' Nora. Blimmin' Nora. Didn't tell me I had a torch over there, did they? There's blimmin' lights and stuff. God dear, oh dear. What are they doing sending me in here? Scooby Dooby, there's somebody over there. Hello, what's that? Rations, here we go. I found some pasties. Oh my god, no, get back, get back, get back, get back. I just want, I just want to chin somebody. I wonder if I can jump him, let's stab him. That one crawling on the floor underneath him is not the best. Run away, 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 run away. He's after me. Just run around that cone thing. Just run around there. Run around there. Run around. Do they run around? Oh dear, oh dear. Not the crawl. Get up. Oh, there we go. It's a punch bag. Dear, oh dear. Oh, he's getting up again. Oh no. Oh my 
God, I must be the most gentle espionage bloke in the world. Oh, no. I hope you're enjoying this mission, folks. We're 14 minutes in. This is a big mission. I'm not going to have any fancy stuff on this one. Oh, my God, there's more blokes here. I don't know what to do. I can't even hide behind that thing. I can't see anything. When I say triangle, let's have a look. Where am I going here, folks? Oh, God, look at me. Um, footprints are these. Yeah, these footprints. They're mates, aren't they? I'm going to chin him. I'm going to chin him. I'm not. I don't know what I'm going to do here, folks. Mm. I don't like there. Let's carry on. Oh, stop. It's ducked. I don't know why I'm whispering. They can't hear me. I'm sat in my, I'm sat in my living room. No. Ah. The shadow's here. There's a guy in the corner there or something. But the cameras are ducked. It's a camera. Oh my God, look at this guy. He's right next to me. Great. How am I going to get past that one? All right, folks. <sighs> I think that ducks in the perfect position. Here we go. I've nicked some stuff out of their van. What I'm doing is following their, sussing out their routes. So then, I reckon it's the way in here. Oh my God, I'm calling. Oh, piss off. I think, well, Can you believe that? Can you believe that? They just call me. What are these people doing? They just call me when I'm trying to get in. I don't know what this means. Oh, hello. Some rats there, folks. What are you on about? Hey, oh, thanks, McDonald. It's been a long time. What are you doing here? Master. So I moved out here for some peace oh, thanks for that, mate. Just like you. Once in a while, I... Right, okay, folks. Let's just hold it there. That's 20 minutes of Solid Snake. That episode was brought to you by Foster Grant's sunglasses. Um, tune in for the next episode coming up very, very soon. Catch you guys on the flip side.